channel I am back here again playing some more crazy crap for you and I got this cool little jester hat on that I got from one of my cows I actually killed quite a lot of cows just for their hats but it's okay because we have enough of them to keep on going uh, so I have a lot of things planned out already in our little adventure backpack I love doing this this is like this is almost more, more fun for me than like actually playing is like figuring out what I'm gonna put in my adventure backpack because that's what we're gonna do today but anyways, oh, I'm losing eggs. Uh, I guess first let's just go over some house improvements, I guess, kind of. So I did add these extra walls, like, over here in the back and on this side for the Easter bunnies. And I just realized I didn't pick up my droppers, which kind of bugs me. But um, I'm going to go check outside and see if it's helping at all. I think it is. I think it is. I think that they're all, now all of the eggs are being picked up by the droppers and they're not like glitching through the walls. I still have this system over here set up with, oh, whoops, I clicked on the hopper with uh, going into this chest. Oh my gosh, there's a lot. I have two Easter bunnies in here now because I have literally, s did he just poop out a diamond? What was that? What was it? It was like bright blue. Maybe it was this, I don't know. But I have, I have two of them in there going just because I wanted to have all the eggs and then over here is what I set up look how cool that looks you can see all there's the king right there I set up this little thing so it's not really connected to any of the other hopper system so I still have to like manually take them out of this chest and put them over there I started filling up all these chests down here like well I didn't I only got to like this one but it was like kind of annoying because this is kind of like my inventory wall and eventually I'm probably gonna sort them by like mod or by item type I'm not quite sure yet but so I wanted to keep all these freed up so I just built this over here so it'll all fill up it'll probably be filled up by tomorrow let's be honest I just afk on here whenever I leave the house so I just put all the eggs in this top chest and then they go zoop, zoop, boop, boop, down and then into here which I think that this isn't actually very effective because some of them end up in this hopper right here but not very many of them Look how many eggs I have. <gasps> oh my gosh. And I put the king and the prince and the queen and the princess up here. Just because I thought they looked cool at the top. Have you, has anyone realized that the prince is smaller than the princess? But like when you spawn them, they're the same size. Oh wait, are they? I'm not sure. That's weird, isn't it? And then over here, I kind of did the same thing as well. Actually, I did this before I did that. Uh, this is my random chest. So it'll just... Because I had two. I think it was these two two random chests and they both had like some of the same items i was like oh i kind of want to like combine these two but it was too full i've taken quite a lot of stuff out and learned it in my little transmutation table but so now i can just put things in here or in here and then it will all be sorted into here or i mean like it'll fill up eventually i know it um and then i don't know what else is left we only have two dogs left, which is really sad that most of them got killed by the Ender Reaper that was in my house. I don't think I was recording when that happened, but it was when I, yeah, I wasn't recording because I was still building because there, this wasn't, this wall wasn't here because things spawn behind there, but they can't get in here because it's like blocked off. But an Ender Reaper got in here and my dogs went to my rescue, but a lot of them died in the process, which is really sad. Uh, I got a little over a stack of gapples just from killing these enchanted golden apple cows and then using this little critter cage glitch to, like, make them adults and change them, make it so that they can breed again. That one has a hat back there, but I already have that hat. I already have that hat too, I think. Um, there's, there's so many in here. I need to, I need to start doing that again with the critter cages i got up to 345 kills so i have a tier three i think to get tier five you need a thousand kills so i'm like a third of the way there um and then lastly i wanted to talk about i was reading the or spawn wiki okay so on the or spawn wiki they have like a whole bunch of guides for different things and i know or spawn isn't the only mod in this mod pack but it's definitely the biggest mod and it's like the most game impacting mod in my opinion and so there's this things to do guide and i kind of want to do all of these things which some of them 
uh, kind of are a little bit advanced from now. But I know that we've already done a few of them. Like right here it says, um, try using a miner's dream in the mine dimension. We did that. Find something fun to do with lava foam. I did that in my hallway. Uh, make yourself a complete set of ultimate armor and ultimate tools and weapons. I did that except I didn't make the ultimate uh, fishing rod because I didn't think I was going to need it. But another thing says you can go fishing in with the ultimate sword in the nether and you can catch an, a fire eel, I think. I'm not sure, but there's like definitely a lot of things I want to do on here, like ride a hoverboard, um, ride a giant spider robot. Oh, get a boyfriend. I want to do that too. Try a Krabby Patty. So many fun things I want to do. I want to try to do a lot of these before this series is over, uh, which brings us to, oh, an egg popped right out. A red ant one at that. Oh, wait, what's that? Jeffrey, no, I don't want you. Which brings us to our adventure backpack. Yes, so the first thing we have in the adventure backpack is I already like put this in here like this because I figured I could just drag it over here and let's see what we're gonna make. Yes, okay, so this is, oh my gosh, that's so cool. This is a deco bench and I'm not sure where I'm gonna put this I think I want to make like a room like a you know like a bedroom but I th it's gonna be across from the golden actually it might be farther down I'm not really sure yet I have no clue but there's a whole lot of cool furniture items in this deco bench so I think I think we can pick it up I mean it's not like it's hard to make we're gonna put it down right here oh my gosh it looks so cool I'm so excited to use this. So I think that we have to get this special kind of clay. I think you need this, the red craft, red crafting clay, which is actually a lot easier than I thought. Hmm. Does it have an exchange? It does. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go make some of these and then put them in my little transmutation table and then maybe we'll make something. Uh, this is really weird. The red crafting clay and the green crafting clay have exchange energy and I just learned them. And I thought this was a glitch or something and it just wasn't going in. But the blue crafting clay doesn't have an exchange value. Which might be because blue crafting clay is made from lapis. And are these both 13.5? Yeah, because both of these are come from plants and then blue comes from lapis. So I would think that's why it does it like that. I'm not sure. Here, let's get a whole bunch of this. Here, I just want to get like a stack of it. Let's do this because that makes life easier. And then green, get all of that. And then I guess let's get some lapis. Just get a stack of it. Oh, we need a stack of uh, dirt and sand and then sand so that'll just give us a whole lot of blue crafting clay right there dirt and then sand so, oh my gosh that's so much oh my god there's so much like left over pick all that up oh it's like literally one block literally one block of crafting clay didn't fit in it or not block you know like thing uh let's just how do we put where do we put this add to table Okay, we're going to just have a whole lot of blue for whatever reason. Uh, put you in there. Put you in there. And there we go. Okay, what can we make? Kind of want to make this Rubik's Cube. I think we're going to make a Rubik's Cube. There we go. There's also a piano. I don't know what I'm doing with a piano, but it's so cool. Uh, what else is in here? Tanning cow rack? Uh, no thanks. Oh, gravestone. We need to. Can I get them? Oh, wait. I only wanted one. Okay. Never mind. No, I guess I already made it. Too late. Uh, I want to go put these in our graveyard. Oh, I want a TARDIS. Is this how you get the TARDIS? I doubt it is. Oh, a fall wreath. I'll put this on the front of my house. I'm having so much fun with this. 
What else? Can we get a swing set? And a slide? We're gonna have a playground outside. We're gonna have lots of fun. What's what's we need uh I want the big Christmas tree. We'll have to get some more things. What's all the sign? No, I don't want that. Um like I'll do all this bedroom stuff later. All these beds. What are all these? Oh, are those YouTubers? I don't know. I've never heard of these people. Let's get a bubblegum machine. Because why not? And... Uh, let's get a jug of milk to put outside our cow room. Just because that'll be funny. Okay, I think that's enough things for now. We have too many things. Let's go put these gravestones in our graveyard. Oh, these are... Oh, this map's so cool. We're going to go over here to the graveyard and put down some gravestones for you can't place that some things in the way. Oh, put that one there. This is like a littler one here. Can I put that there and then right there? Oh, it's so sad. I need to uh, make a memorial for the dogs that were lost to the Ender Reaper. Maybe I'll, do, I'll remember to do that later. I was going to do it before I recorded this, but then I just guess I forgot. Uh, that's so sad. What, are we, what can we do with this? I'm going to put this milk jug right outside here. Actually, I have another plan for this hallway, but I'll tell you. Oh, it's so little. It's so cute. And a fall wreath. Where are we going to put this? We should put this. Can we put it on the door? Can we? Will it go? It won't go on the door, will it? We'll put it right there. That's pretty. And then bubblegum machine. Yay. Yes. Uh, we need this in our kitchen for sure. Oh my god. There's little pieces of bubblegum in there. And then a Rubik's Cube. Oh, it's so little. I'll have to put that in my room. And I'll put the TARDIS right there. It'll be like a cookie jar. Oh my gosh. I got so many things from that. I forgot. <sighs> we shouldn't be outside right now because it's raining, you know. Let's play it. Can I break you flowers? Because you're not right there. I want you to be right there. Oh my gosh, we got a little... Here, let's put the... These flowers are annoying. I need to get a bucket of water out here is what I need. Will you go... Right there? Sweet. I should probably move this because... Oh, I should probably move it because it's a little close. Oh my gosh, when it's like sitting there floating. That's the funniest thing ever. Put it right there. Okay, perfect. We got ourselves a little park outside our house. So cute. Going up the side like a bad person. Don't be that kid at the park. Oh, and then we have a piano. A grand piano. Where are we going to put this thing? Uh, I guess. Oh my god, it's so huge. Where's the front of it? Where's the part where you sit? Oh, okay, right here. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. Input piano music here. Woo! Okay, what's next? What was the next thing I wanted to do? Actually, let's check on our eggs. Hmm, I got more kings. I don't really want that many kings, but... Easter Bunny, you OP pooping out those kings, though. Are those, like, your children? <sighs> next thing I wanted to do. I found this cool thing on... Whoops on the f wiki which is called a thunder staff and i don't know what it does but i saw that i had the materials to make it and actually i could probably have enough to make two and i wanted to make it so i'm kind of scared it might burn down my house i know it probably oh my god it blows things up that's not good can i can i hit him oh my god I'm going to blow that up over there. Okay. Thunderstaff OP. Um, uh, I'll just I'll just put this away and, you know, lock it up so no one can get to it. Although, I mean, who's going to get here? Because no one else plays here. Anyways, the next thing I saw, which also came from the forums. I think it was in, like, the thing. I know it was in the things to do, but I don't know where it was. And it says sift through sand and dirt. And I don't know 
what you can get from it, but you have to get the sifter. And I guess we'll just go down over here to... Oh, is that a mole? I need to beat him for a big Bertha. Oh my gosh. I could go kill him right now. I'm gonna go kill him. I killed a mantis earlier. I didn't even know that was part of the big Bertha, but I killed- Oh my god, stop hurting me! Did I get your nose? I need your nose. There we go! Sweet! We got two parts of big Bertha- well, three parts, because we have a- an ultimate sword that I already made. But I wanted to sift through the sand, and I don't know how to do this. Uh. I, I don't know. Oh my gosh, it's pulling things out of the sand. Oh, okay. It's pulling random things that I don't think I really would want. Lots of iron leggings. Some potatoes. Uh... Just gonna keep going. Just gonna keep sifting, you know? You know how it goes. Got a poppy, got a poisonous potato. What's up with all this iron armor? Does this have an exchange value? It does. I can put all that on my exchange table. I'm gonna start filling this up with all this stuff because, uh, you know, I don't want it. Eh, not you. You can stay. Here, let's put. I just need to organize my inventory. That's my big problem in life. Black flower? What is you? Hmm. Well, if I ever need iron stuff, I can- I know how to get it. I probably should have made this when I first started playing. That probably would have helped out quite a bit. Let's just- uh, I'm done. I'm bored with this. Let's open our chemical bag. Here we go. I'll put all this into my exchange table. I don't really want any of this stuff. Yeah, I'll learn that. That's cool. Um, yeah, let's, let's just go back home. Okay, so I'm back here at home and let me put this sifter away. That's pretty cool. Uh, I'd like to like just sit there and just keep on sifting, you know? Which actually defeating this mole, molenoid, reminded me of- I was gonna talk about this earlier but I forgot. I started setting up for the big Bertha. Well, I didn't really set up for it, but I had, I was just like looking through the eggs and I noticed that I have quite a lot of the eggs and I started to actually look through the eggs and I have every, every spawn egg for everything that you need for the big Bertha, which, uh, where's the mole? I'll put you here. And I also fought a mantis earlier, so I already had the mantis claw. So I figured, uh, well, maybe we'll start on this the next episode. Maybe we'll take it one piece at a time. I know this one is probably going to be the hardest to get. Well, actually, maybe not. I put the attack squids here because that's how you get the kraken. You have to hurt an attack or you have to kill an attack squid and then the kraken spawns on some. Which, actually, speaking of that, I wanted to spawn a cephalodrone and I think for him you needed raw beef so i'll just take all that why not uh actually bed pet bed pet i feel like that was a song i want to i want to i know you can't like tame him but you can fly him and he's supposed to fight the kraken for you um can are you hungry are you hungry mister okay how do i ride you how do i oh i'm riding him does he listen to me? Does he listen to me at all? Or does is he just like, where's the Kraken? I'm gonna get the Kraken. That's what he's doing. Okay. Well. Hmm. He's not going nowhere. Okay. Well. Bye, Mr. Cephalodrome. See you when I fight the Kraken. He's just gonna chill i have another one of him so if whenever we actually go to fight the kraken we'll have that uh next thing in here oh the boyfriend this is my favorite part actually let me get rid of this beef first 
Okay, phew, got all that cleared out. Got my uh, alchemical bag emptied out from all that sifting things. I, I got, I don't really know how much energy, but I learned how to make a whole set of iron if I ever need iron armor for any reason. Uh, so the next thing on here is the boyfriend. And I don't, I know you need a steak. Let me just get a few of these, see if he's hungry. Uh, I guess I'll leave him in here. He can play the piano. Oh, I don't like your skin. How do I- I think I can critter cage him. Okay, so I'll just keep critter caging him until I find one I like. <sighs> oh, actually, that, I don't mind that one. Okay. You can be my boyfriend. There you go. Are you my boyfriend now? Are you gonna follow me? Okay. Uh, well, come back over here, actually. Come here. Come over uh, Oh wait, you want the steak? Are you my boyfriend? I don't know yet. I think he's my boyfriend now. Okay, come over here. Come over here. Or you can just walk around. Here. Have this. No, don't go behind the piano. Right here. There you go. No, now you're just like stuck in the wall. Get out of the wall. Over. No, like come, walk this way. Get out. You're like have your bodies in the wall. Okay, you know what? I don't care. I'm just gonna leave you. You can just- Are you gonna follow me now? Okay, there you go. There you go. Right? You're gonna chill by the dogs? There you go. You can take care of the dogs for me. Okay, so now we have a boyfriend. I'm not really sure what we're gonna do with him, but he's there. He's just gonna live in my house for no reason whatsoever. Okay, so this idea came from Mia Tasker, although they said that it is actually someone else's idea, which I think I probably know where you got it from because I watch a lot of uh, the- big YouTubers play Crazy Craft 2, uh, which is to make a mannequin. Where is it? A mannequin, which is made from a pumpkin, uh, wood, and an equipment cube. And I looked up how to make this, and it's just wool and iron. So, and these also have an exchange value, so I just have to make one of them, and I can always make them. But the problem with this is to, to get the skin on the person, you have to name it with a name tag and I don't know how to get name tags because I tweaked some of the mods and removed some of them. Oh, what is this? Equipment library. What are these things? I don't know. Here, let's just, I want to make you, okay. There we go. Put the iron in the middle and then we put the wool all around here and then- Sorry, bed pet! There's your food. Oh wait, I missed one. There we go. Equipment cube and then with the equipment cube, we do this. We can- Oh, I didn't realize it made 16 equipment cubes. Oh well. That has an exchange value so we'll just keep that. And now I have one mannequin and I don't know why it's all messed up like that. But I'm actually gonna put these in here. Just so that I know how to make them. And then here I'll show you what it looks like. Although I think it's going to look messed up right now. Yeah. So, but then you can put a name tag on him. And then you can change it to your skin. And if anyone leaves a helpful comment, I will put you in my hallway. So make sure you, if you comment something, uh, include your IGN so that I can add you to my hallway. And I didn't really want to do this. Because I didn't, I felt like I was copying Strawberry Jam, but other YouTubers have done it too, so why not? There we go. And then here we need the man. Get, oh, you can only drag one at a time. Okay, so if you comment something helpful or something nice or just like tell me what you want me to do and I'll pick your comment and I'll put you in my hallway and your skin will be there. Not that. I'm just gonna have to figure out how to get name tags. I'm probably just gonna have to cheat them in because it's not gonna work to- I'm not gonna find them anywhere. So that will be a thing and that's gonna be the end of this episode of Crazy Craft. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this series and again if you have any helpful tips or ideas or what you want me to do in future episodes leave them in the comments below and include your IGN and I will cheat in some name tags just for that purpose only for the purpose of the mannequins uh so see you guys next time bye